Patriots, welcome to Rex Pine TV. I'm Ronnie Osen. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Thursday, February 4th, 2021. Let's go to Aiden for our Black History Spotlight. Thank you, Vani. Today we spotlight the National Association for the Advancement of Colored People, also known as the NAACP. The NAACP was founded on February 12th, 1909 in New York City. This year marks its 112th year anniversary. Spurred by growing racial violence in the early 20th century, and particularly by 1908 race riots in Springfield, Illinois, a group of African American leaders joined together to form a new permanent civil rights organization. The, NDO, the NAACP works tirelessly to ensure that people are treated equally and fairly. Now let's go to Chris for the sports highlight. Thank you, Aiden. Today's sports highlights are presented to you by the Patriots. Naomi Osaka is Japan's first Grand Slam winner. The now 20-year-old Naomi stunned the world by winning the 2018 Women's U.S. Open Singles Championship, stopping Serena's quest to achieve her 24th Grand Slam title and tying with Australia's Margaret Court for the record. Naomi's first Grand Slam victory was particularly sweet given that she is the first Japanese tennis player to achieve this honor. Naomi caught the world's attention at the age of 16 after defeating former U.S. Open champion Samantha Stoser at the 2014 Bank of the West Classic. Her first major WTA victory came in March 2018 when she beat Russia's Daria Kadatina to grab the biggest title outside of the Grand Slams, the BMP Powerball, open in Indian Wells, California. Now let's go to Noah to see what's for lunch. Today's lunch is hot dog, baked beans, baby carrots, ranch, sliced apples, and milk. Bon appetit! Now let's go back to Vani. Thank you, Noah. Scholars, let's keep working towards our goal of 30 lessons with February I Ready Reading Challenge. Pass 30 Reading I Ready lessons between February 1st and February 26th to be a part of a spectacular sub party. Start today to get all 30 lessons in. Let's check out the fun highlights as some of our very own Patriots showed off their dance moves yesterday with the Fresh Prince Challenge. was awesome. Patriots, we continue celebrating Black History. Today, it's time to show off your moves by recording your class or team doing the electric slide or cha-cha slide. Tomorrow, Friday, we will rock our favorite Black History t-shirt. Be sure to tune in every day to see what fun activity or a dress down will be going on for the rest of the February. And finally, scholars, let's take a moment to celebrate those students that have earned honor roll for quarter two. to congratulate your friends when you see them. Now let's see what the weather's going to be like today with David. Thank you, Vonnie. Today's weather in Pembroke Pines, Florida is forecast to be 73 degrees Fahrenheit and mostly sunny. Looks like that sun won the battle. Now let's go to Samuel for the joke of the day. Thank you, David. 
And here's today's joke of the day. If you had 10 chocolates and your friend asked you for eight, how much would you have left? 10 chocolates and one less friend. Now let's go back to Bonnie. Thank you, Samuel. That was great. And now let's check in with Sonia for today's birthdays. Thank you, Bonnie. Today's birthday girls are Scarlett McCartney, Sarah Benjamin, and Elizabeth Gomez. Happy birthday. Let's get back to Bonnie. Thank you, Sonia. Patriots, don't forget your pet's expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Miss Silvera, Miss Jimenez, Miss Julian, Miss Newton, Miss Stone, and Miss Dry. You had the correct answer to yesterday's riddle, which was, when you need me, you throw me away. But when you are done with me, you bring me back. What am I? The correct answer to the riddle was an anchor. Now for today's riddle. I am used in most sports. I have four holes, come in many different colors, and there's a state that shares my name. What am I? Again, I am used in most sports. I have four holes, come in many different colors, and there is a state that shares my name. What am I? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for your response to be reviewed. Winners will be announced the following day. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a thankful Thursday. And don't forget, remember, reunite, rise, have a great day! Thank you.